are tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. Well, black and white sports fans, we need to talk about Bronny James and the Lakers. Because you guys know that LeBron James is now re-signed with the Lakers on a two-year deal. Really one-year deal because he has a player option for the second year. But the Lakers did draft his son. So now, guys, LeBron and Bronny will become the first father-son duo to play on the same team in NBA history. That's the narrative right there. Even though a lot of people believe, including myself, that Bronny James is not an NBA player. He's not. The Lakers, man, they have bent the knee to LeBron James. This team is not very good. They'll probably win, you know, 43, 44 games, similar to what they actually have won last year. Maybe they actually end up becoming back-to-back um, in-season tournament champions. Maybe they'll actually raise another banner, even though the Lakers said they're not going to do that. Yeah, the Lakers are a joke. A joke. This was a stunt set up by LeBron James to put the attention on him. And now the Lakers, man, are really going to have attention on them for the first week of the season. Yes, a premier franchise like the Lakers, they want to make headlines instead of actually, um, you know, winning championships. Because with the Bronny James uh, draft pick, they are obviously not really in the business of trying to win a championship. They're trying to make headlines. They're trying to tell a story. Nothing more. And now we got more proof, guys, that um, this Bronny James pick that was just for optics to tell a story. Let's get into this, guys. Make sure you guys like this video, subscribe to the channel, become a channel member, member live stream every single Friday at 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. We appreciate the support. So here we go. Check this out, guys. Via Adrian Wojnarowski of ESPN. Bronny James expected to move to G League after debuting with LeBron and Lakers. Yeah. So apparently, maybe just maybe Bronny James is actually going to be on the roster for the Lakers for the first week. For optics to make history. And then they're going to send him to the G League. Now, I thought that um that Rich Paul said a while back, um, that Bronny James would only um is only the NBA for Bronny James. Now he's a second round pick. A lot of those pits end up in the G League. But Rich Paul said that um no, it's not gonna happen. But Bronny James is actually a second round pick. So Wojnowski says there's no expectations that Bronny James is gonna make the roster for the Lakers. But they're going to put him out there for optics. Man. We need to watch on some of this clip here, guys. Let's go and watch this right here. All NBA, NBA eyes will be on that game. And for more on the Lakers, we welcome in our senior NBA insider, Adrian Wojnarowski. So what, was, what are people saying about the realistic expectations for Bronny? Well, what the Lakers' expectations are is that he'll largely be a G League player like almost any 19-year-old player coming in the league drafted in the second round. I think what you'll ultimately probably see is Bronny James in the first week of the season on the court with his father um, in, in a very, I, I don't want to call it ceremonial, but it's going to, the, the eyes of the world will be on that. They'll do that the first week of the season, but there's no expectation Bronny James is going to be in the Lakers rotation. He'll spend a lot of his time playing with their G League team, which shares a practice facility with the Lakers. Okay, so maybe get the father-son moment out of the way, and then it's on to development. So uh, his father, meanwhile, that's what now we talk about. He opted out of his contract. He's expected to stay a Laker. What do we think his new deal is going to look like? Well, actually, um, we already know what uh, LeBron James's deal is. But you heard it right there, man. Woj said he didn't want to call it a ceremonial role. But in reality, man, it's a ceremonial role. Nothing more. 
So he's saying that the Lakers are going to put Bronny James out there on the court just for optics. The first week of the season, then after that, you got to leave because you can't play. You can't play. This is embarrassing, man, for Bronny. I almost feel kind of bad for him, man. This is the monster that LeBron James created here. I want to play my son. My final season will be play my son. And there's no expectations whatsoever that Bronny James can actually make it on the NBA roster. But apparently he's going to be on the NBA roster for one total week. That's probably what? Two, three games. And I can already see guys ESPN. They'll have that game on ESPN for sure. For sure. We're making NBA history. LeBron James and LeBron James uh, Jr. Because I believe on um, Bronny James's uh, jersey had James Jr. Now I'm wondering if LeBron is actually going to um, change his jersey a little bit and put LeBron Sr. on there. Now we know that... Um, LeBron is definitely has some regrets about naming his son after him because Bronny is actually um, named LeBron James Jr. But he goes by Bronny. That's a regret right there for LeBron James. Man, I feel bad for the kid. Because them drafting Bronny was a stunt. And Wolves just pretty much confirmed that this is a stunt. Nothing more. The Lakers, man, this the Lakers, man. They won how many championships? 17, 17 championships. And they stooped to this level here. Just for optics, man, this is sad, man. If Dr. Buss is still alive, I don't believe Dr. Buss would be doing this. I really don't. I don't believe that uh, Dr. Buss would allow LeBron James to get his weight like this. And look at the Lakers, man. His team with the Lakers has been a joke. One bubble title and that's it. Nothing more. One bubble title that a lot of people have no respect for whatsoever. And LeBron James is really greatly underachieved, man, with the Lakers. Definitely underachieved. But there you have it, man. He's going to play with his son for like maybe two games. That's about it. About two games. (laughs) This is hilarious, man. This is really, really hilarious right here. So there you have it, guys. It was all a stunt. It was all made up. Bronny James really won't be an NBA player. That's that saying right there. But that's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports fans. Let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. And we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.